Hey, what's up, guys? We're showing you low light test of the uh, K6000 car DVR. You can go to Amazon.com. It shoots 1080p at 30 frames per second. We're also going to show you some footage at night, just the car and the camera on a dark road, not with any other cars around. And you will see there's a big difference in quality, but it is also shooting 1080p, 30 frames per second. So let me know in the comment section below do you like the quality? of the camera there's no night vision on it whatsoever it just shoots 1080p 30 frames per second 720p and vga which is uh 480 on youtube with the black bars and the quality is horrible so i recommend you guys using this camera in the in the 1080p setting that's where you get the sharpest clearest image and as you can see it's doing a pretty damn good job at low light on the freeway so i'm going to switch over to the road where it was just the car and the camera and that was it. So now you're probably being able to tell a big difference in uh, video quality. I think the video quality for shooting at night is still pretty decent. You can still see what is going on here in the uh, video. Yes, it has a lot of street lights, but you're being able to see at least what's in front of you. So if you got hit by another car or you hit like somebody on a bike, you'd be able to make out what happened. Like I said, for $25, the car DVR, the K6000, does what it's supposed to do, and it does it very well. We've had this car DVR probably about a little bit over a month, and we've been pleasantly surprised how good this camera is. It's the best camera I would recommend. It's the only dash cam that I've ever used, but out of all the quality I've ever seen for the price range, this blows everything out the water. You get some for 25 bucks that are blurry that aren't full screen, that don't have audio, that are just plain garbage. But for a cheap Chinese car DVR, I would highly recommend you guys checking this one out. It's the K6000 car DVR. You can check it out on Amazon.com. And with that being said, remember to rate, even if you hate, comment, subscribe, and I'll definitely talk to you guys next time. But like I said, the quality at night does pretty decent. In, in daytime, it does very well. So I'll see you guys soon. Thanks for watching as always. Bye-bye.